everybody, it's Joe from Choice Physical Therapy. Casey is joining me. Hey guys. The mustaches, uh, we really went for it. No shave November. Uh, question for this week, apologize it's a couple days late with uh, Thanksgiving. Uh, the question this week was how to manage shin pain, uh, either after a run or in preparation for a run, some strategies that you can use to prevent shin pain. Um, so first one we're gonna do, you can grab a lacrosse ball. Uh, you can also use a baseball, um, any hard, Ball. So what Casey's going to do is have a seat in the chair. One of the muscles that gets overused commonly with shin splints and shin pain is the tibialis anterior, so kind of towards the front of your shin on the outside. So Casey's just going to take that ball and roll it down. So this is something you could use to prep um, prior to a run. You could also use it um, like maybe the day after the run to help to facilitate some blood flow and help that muscle spasm relax. After you've spent uh, maybe a minute or two rolling through the tender points of that muscle, then what you're gonna do, Casey's gonna bring his foot behind and he's gonna lay it down. Perfect. So with this, you wanna try to keep everything lined up and uh, Casey, where do you feel that stretch? Right in the front of my leg. So you get a little stretch along that front part of the shin that you just rolled out with the ball. A lot of times this muscle gets overused uh, while you're running. So if you increase your running volume too quickly, usually only try to increase about 10% uh, in terms of distance uh, each week for your runs. If you've changed footwear, um, the, the front of the calf muscle can also get overused if your calf, the back of the calf muscle uh, is a little tight. So remember to keep up with your calf stretching, but add in the lacrosse ball to the front part of your shin, as well as that stretch for the front part of the ankle. Uh, you can do both in sitting. Hopefully no more shin splints. Have a great weekend. Hope everyone's having a good holiday season so far. Bye guys.